Bro, Shep Owens is unguardable. Jimmy Butler for three. It's good! Jimmy Butler from downtown ties the game. Oh, a depot from downtown. This man's got 27. All right, welcome back to this Gerald Johnson micro. And as you can see by the lineup, we have another injury and that is going to our sixth man Kyle Lowry who is likely to miss this entire series with a sprain MCL and if we can make it to the NBA finals he will most likely be back but that is a huge huge loss because now I'm going to be log jamming some more minutes at point guard we have Dennis Smith playing um a little bit and Bam Adebayo is still hurt I'm expecting he'll be back next game hopefully but that now means we we got a next man up, which is Dennis Smith Jr. We playing that backup point guard role, and I did say last episode I was gonna bench Oladipo, and I mean it couldn't have came at a better time because we need a bench scorer and facilitator, and hopefully Oladipo can be that with Kyle Lowry out, and I am starting Seth Curry for hopefully the shooting, because as you know with 2K the shooting from your AI teammates is not very good. I was hopefully he can hit some shots. And other than that, lineup's going to be exactly the same. I gave Jimmy Butler now 44 minutes instead of his 42 from last game. So the minutes are going up. Like I said, I can't give myself any more minutes than I already have. Uh, but I'm expected to play a lot. Without further ado, we took game one. Let's see if we can take game two in Miami and take this series over to Brooklyn. And for this game, I'm deciding I'm going to make the executive decision to go with no shot meter and see if that can work see if that can improve my shooting a little bit we'll see we'll see i maybe i won't take as many threes i say that and then i end up taking like 17 but malik monk in the corner he's hurt he's starting off the game with the brick yurts of in with the rebound but we'll see if it actually works if it does maybe i'll keep it off because i know you get a boost you've gotten a boost for the past few 2ks jimmy butler start us off with a dunk Seth Curry's open. Let's see. Ah, uh, Malik Monk closed out. I was going to pull that, but uh, Shep Owens, fastest man alive. Right into the paint. That's an easy dunk in the lane. Jimmy Butler and Gerald Johnson, first two to strike for the Miami Heat. Who else? And as you know, I got a triple-double, another one last game, and that is continuing my streak of every single round in these playoffs. Game one, I've had a triple double let's we'll see if i can continue that if we make it to the finals near steal there for johnson shep owens into the paint good switch from kayla martin and i contested it enough to get the miss but al horford is just too big and he's gonna get that layup i'm surprised they're not playing al horford at center but i mean i guess it's working because they got kayla martin on him uh jimmy go to work buddy oh first shot without the shot me that's late isn't it yep Al Horford is cooking us right now. Eight points. Eight out of the ten points is from Al Horford taking over this game two of the Eastern Conference Finals. I expected him to play well at least one of these games. I don't know why you're been switched there. I expected him to play well at least one of these games with a smaller uh, Caleb Martin on him. I should be able to guard Bielitsa here, right? It's Bielitsa after all. Yeah, he had to get rid of it. All right, we're going to sub out. They do keep Jimmy Butler in the game, so I will take it. We have Jimmy Butler still in the game. Down by one, we got ourselves a game here once again, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if it can stay this competitive. Uh, no Jimmy Butler in the game. All right, this is my time to go full offensive mode. Uh, kick it out to KCP. Uh, KCP, give it back to me. Cutting back door, and that's a dunk. Not having Jimmy in the game, the guard KD is really starting to uh, show here as KD is just taking over. That is not. I I never have enough time to to get open on those. That should be a wow, man. I am on the struggle bus right now. We need Jimmy in this game, man. I can't even score. Al Horford gets wide open for three. Luckily, he's gonna miss. I, like, Shep Owens is locking me down. I can't get by him at all. Like, he just chases back up to me. And I'm not even able to draw fouls. And Bielitsa wide open in the corner. Luckily misses. Bro, Al Horford is killing us on the offensive glass. 
not having another big man in the game is really showing its colors right now. When they have Al Horford, a 7-footer. It's not going well. Caleb, I'm banking on... Why would you pass out of that? Dude, why would you pass out of that? That that was such a sell, and now I'm going to have to shoot this. I have no choice. I'd rather have... Me oh, yo, yo, yo. Why would you pass out of that shot? And then we have Seth Curry. Oh, my God. That just sold that whole possession. There was no reason to pass out of that shot, Caleb. Luckily, Jimmy Butler gets back in the game, but... He, why would you not just take... You gotta take that shot, dude. You Oh, never mind. Jimmy's not back in the game. That was just KCP. Oh, my goodness. This is going horrifically bad so far. And now Yurt's gonna go to the line, and he's gonna struggle at the line like he always does. We're getting killed right now. Well, I don't know why Jimmy Butler isn't in the game. Like, why have they sat him for so long? We're getting murdered. And that's... Oh, my... Don't jump for... Now I gotta call a timeout. Because that would have been a jump ball. Don't die for that. I was right there. They better not sub me out. Because that just be the dumbest. Thank you. Dan and Jimmy Butler's in the game. Bro, you can't wait for us to go down by this much. By eight. And then decide to put him in the game. Like, it's not smart. Let's see if I can hit a three. Nope. Never mind. Green bean. I'll take that. And just got us to lead back after an and one over Kevin Durant. And I activated my takeover early so they wouldn't sub me out this quarter. And so far, it's been working because I have a feeling I would have been subbed out uh, like a minute ago. But I'm still in the game because they have Dennis Smith Jr. in the game. So I definitely would have been subbed out. But I forced my way into it because we, we need me and Butler to play as much as humanly possible. That also means I don't have to guard um, Ben Simmons, Alex Lenman. You can't be getting into foul trouble like this. That's another thing. If um, any of our bigs, Yurt's event, wow, I don't know how the hell with my takeover, Joe Harris contested that. I don't know, bro. It's 2K I, at the end of the day. Like, who cares? I don't. If any of our bigs get into foul trouble, we're screwed. We have no other big men on the roster as KD knocks down a three and takes the lead back. This is going to be the final possession of the first half. We have a one-point lead. Let's see if we can extend that going into the half. Jimmy Butler to the rack, mid-range game, and you already know it, Jimmy Butler. It's automatic, and we are going to have a three-point lead going into halftime. Quick look at the halftime stats. I know I don't do that. I have 25 points at the half. Butler only has seven, but that is going to change. We're getting great contribution from our role players, KCP, Caleb Martin, and Victor Oladipo, all with five, and no one else really doing anything on the other end. It's honestly just Al Horford killing us, bro. He's got 14 points, 9 rebounds. Kevin Durant is once again in purgatory with um, Jimmy Butler on him. We just got to try and figure out something to do against Al Horford. And another turnover for the Miami Heat as the Nets continue their run. Oh, my God. I thought he was going to pass that to Shep. What are you? Oh, my goodness, bro. We're just collapsing right now. What is happening? Collapsing on defense. The, the offense is just Jimmy Butler and I with the pick and roll. Like, my goodness. I can't play off ball because Kyle Lowry doesn't play, so I don't get to play shooting guard. Anytime I give up the ball to try and set a screen to get open for three, they immediately pass it back and they don't give me time. And then Kevin Durant, screen. That's a bucket. Five-point lead for the Nets. Big steal by Yurt. I'm on the run. Yurtsevin with the dunk. Perfect time to get team takeover too because you already know how 2K is with fast breaks. You're, the AI does not run full sprint. They jog. And the Nets are going to call a timeout. Bro, Shep Owens is unguardable. Jimmy Butler for three. It's good. Jimmy Butler from downtown ties the game. What a shot from Jimmy Butler. That gives Johnson his 10th assist. We are all tied up. Shep Owens with the ball. He has been unguardable as Joe Harris for the mid-range. It's good. I cannot stay in front of anyone. Double teamed. And why would you sub me out? No. This is bad. We're up by 10. Never mind. Hold Depot's got 20 off the bench. I just don't understand it. Maybe I need to change my release. I thought Kyrie's release would be good. 
I've used, I've been good with it, so I don't know why all of a sudden, good defense from Oladipo. I just don't know why all of a sudden, I just, I'm just struggling. Oladipo gets his 24th point. Oladipo from downtown, this man's got 27. He's turning back the clocks. He extends the lead back to nine. With six minutes remaining, no Jimmy Butler in the game, no problem. I have no stamina, by the way. Vic, show him what you're made of. Or Victor Oladipo gets by him. That's 34 for Oladipo tonight. And the Nets need a timeout. I'm going to assume that's going to be it for Vic. If it is, what a showing. I really hope it's not. And Oladipo is going to be subbed out. Yeah, that's just... 2Ks, mechanics, this man could have went for 40, but we're up by 12, but was back in the game, you can basically seal it. Oh, why'd you sub me out, bro? There was really no point. Whatever. Oladipo Masterclass in the books. I don't know how we scored 8 points with 25 seconds, don't even question it. 104 to 121 is your final score, and if we look at the final box score, the Oladipo show, this man did 6 threes, 34.7 rebounds, 2 assists, all off the bench. He had this type of game. He is definitely coming off the bench for the rest of this series. If he's going to put up numbers like that and without Kyle Lowry. We needed reinforcements without Bam and without Lowry. And this man showed up. Struggle of a game for Gerald Johnson once again. But 31 points, 4 rebounds, 17 assists with only 2 turnovers. is nothing to scoff at. Shooting-wise, obviously, if you take my 3s away, what am I? 9 for 15? So, I mean, not really a bad shooting game besides from downtown. I need to stop taking these threes, or I need to figure out my jump shot. Uh, another Jimmy Butler masterclass, 26 points, 4 rebounds, 6 assists on. Fantastic shooting. Only, he didn't need to play more minutes, but if he played more minutes, he definitely would have hit 30. And then Yurtsvin with another 17 rebound game and 3 steals for the Nets once again. Actually, no, last game I played pretty good on him. But this game, Shep Owens just owned me. I could not do anything on this man defensively. But it doesn't matter. It led us to the win. And we did what we needed to. We held our offer to only two points in the second half. He did have seven rebounds. But only two points. Shep Owens was the whole team, basically, in that second half. Kevin Durant, once again, continues to struggle against Jimmy Butler. This time, Jimmy Butler and Oladipo had him. Nine for 21 and two for a six. He is just not having a good time. Malik Monk had a solid game, and Joe Harris is struggling. That's going to be it for me. I'll see you guys game three in Brooklyn. See if we can take a commanding 3-0 series lead. And what's better, competitive series all three quarters. Once you get to the fourth, it's a bit iffy. But that's it for me. GG.